Hi, this is Jim Whitley from the world famous Tool Shed located at 1073 Main Street in Worcester. Hours this week are Wednesday through Saturday, 1 to 5. We can be found on the web at www.use-tools.com. Uh, as of right now, we will be open on Wednesday, normal time. Uh, if it starts to snow and you're concerned, just give a call at 508-753-3738. Or you can check the website. That will be updated to alert you if we are closed. Uh, we're in our six-foot ladder, $25. Uh, 5,000 pound um, uh, cherry picker that is 125 we have a buffer with stand this is $50 have a whole bunch of flap discs those are two dollars three dollars for a box of sandpaper four dollars for that box three dollars for that box four dollars for that box uh, ladder, ladder levelers this is priced somewhere and uh, I don't know what the hell I wrote for their price on that. Um, Porter cable, speed matic, variable speed router. This is $150. $60 for the variable speed rigid scroll saw. We have a Harbor Freight torque wrench. That is $45. A toolbox. I believe this is $7.50. Werner ladder. This is $200. $25. Bargain table this week is at $0.50. Cents. Uh, Husky flooring nailer, pneumatic, this is $120. There is a Bostitch flooring nailer and the hammer's around here somewhere. There it is. That is $170. All right. Uh, circular saw, DeWalt, $50. Bucks. I know that came in last week. Uh, there's a porta cable router. I got uh, plenty of these. $50 for that porta cable router. Uh, pass load um, finish nailer that is 150 knee pad six dollars another porta cable router this one is I believe that one is 60 there is a ram set six dollars and fifty cents for this guy twelve dollars and fifty cents for the rest of the box Craig jig that's forty dollars there is a set of Craftsman turning tools. These are $22.50. Here is a Lee V4S D4R. I'll get you the shot of it so you can go look it up if you like. This is $175. Um, Milwaukee um, cordless tool set. Two sawzalls, a drill, uh, two batteries, charger, circular saw. That is $200. $135 for the uh, wood vise. There's a Makita sharpener, brand new in the box, never been used, two extra stones. This is $250. This is a Fluke PV500 pressure and vacuum module. Uh, that is $130. It actually even comes with instructions. SPI is three to four and a four to five mic. Those are $100 each. Uh, six point craftsman metric sockets. These is uh, what is this forty dollars for the set? I think I can't remember what it is. Probably written on this one that is laying off by itself. Forty bucks for the set. All right, pilot bearing puller. I guess I'll give you the picture of this. This is twenty five dollars. Uh, another rack of sockets, all metric. That is twenty two fifty. Six dollars for the hawk. Uh, Twenty dollars for the drill. There is an Incra 1000 miter. This is ninety-five dollars. Uh, a whole bunch of these little trays. They're around a dollar fifty, two dollars each, somewhere in there. Um, a Bosch impactor chuck attachment. That is ten dollars. Um, blade. Uh, $11.50, $22.50 for the bearing splitter. Incra eye box. This is $85. Um, let's see what else is new here. Tap and die set, $90. A little handheld ratchet, that is $7. A whole bunch of little quarter inch extensions, a quarter inch speed driver, that is $5. Uh, extensions, extensions, extensions. 
the angled turner. That's five dollars. Two dollars for the contour gauge. Two fifty for the blade. Uh, Four dollars for the the hand ratchet. Five dollars for the husky. Um, Thirty dollars for the snap-on SK. Seven dollars. Four dollars for the T handle. Five dollars for this ratchet. Two dollars and fifty cents for the knife. Four dollars for the blades. Two dollars for the outlet. Uh, five dollars for this outlet. The Hubble GFI tester. This is ten dollars. Another set of pullers. Twelve dollars and fifty cents. Thirteen dollars and fifty cents. Uh, gas line disconnect. Eight dollars. Another puller. Nine dollars. Pitman iron puller. Seven dollars. Uh, another. Polar CTA 4011, 4, this is uh, $20. The Jack is $66. There is a Hubble, not Hubble, a SunX uh, lamp, this is $85. Bearing Polar, $13.50. Port device, there's two of them, $60 each. Bearing Splitter, didn't put a price on it. Uh, this puller with a bearing splitter, this is made by OTC, this is $50. There's a $20 Delta belt sander. The disc sander is broken off, so it's just a belt sander, $20. Roto zip with a cutting blade, a whole bunch of cutters in there, that's $40. There's a Presto light torch, hose, tank, $40. Stethoscope, uh, five bucks. Um, square, that is $5. All right. Fuses, dollar fifty, ten dollars, eight fifty, eight dollars, dollar fifty for all these little guys, two dollars for those. These big boys here, that's ten dollars for the package, eight fifty for the hammer. We already talked about this. Don't know what the hell the price is. Ten dollars for the mallet. Uh, what else we got here? Bailey number four, or Stanley, Stanley number four, thirty dollars. There's a record number four, $45, uh, $20 for the crown scribe. There is a set of Greenlee bit brace bits. Look like they're brand new. That is, of course, I should have looked at the price when I had that out. That is $60. We have a snap-on quarter-inch drive. Gun. There's a ratchet. There's three batteries in the charger. That is three hundred dollars. A whole bunch of little stuff there. Two fifty for the knife. Uh, the crown saw. Seven dollars and fifty cents. Iridium files. Twenty bucks. This is a torque adapter. Digital torque adapter. Harbor Freight. This is thirty dollars. Uh, Nicholson files, these are $22.50. The Makita grinder, $65. Some more ratchets, we get some chucks. Jacob's 633C chuck, we have two of those with the keys. Those are $30 each. Uh, $250 for the little, um, what the hell do you call it? Uh, whatever, $1.50 for the screwdriver, $10 for the ratchet. $9 for the breaker bar, whole bunch of extensions, $3, $2, $4, more extensions, more extensions, $4 for the uh, tire bar, $4 for the puller, $8 for the clamp, $4 for that puller. All right, now I know there was a whole bunch of other pullers I got in last week, and uh, I don't I can't remember what is sold or what is not sold, but there's uh, still a whole bunch of stuff to go through. So, again, bargain table, $0.50, cents. if it went in doubt, um, you can check the website for uh, updates to whether we are closed. This is only a set of um, hollowing tools. This is $90 for the set, $40 for the vise. Sunex anti-vibration pads, uh, uh, $50. We have $3 for the key stock assortment, $250 for the Woodruff keys and roll pins. That is $3, uh, $3. All right, so again, if I keep on looking around, I'm gonna get distracted and keep on talking. So again, uh, Wednesday through Saturday, one to five, and we shall see you soon. Thanks a lot.